Ah, you paused it. Uh, uh, you guys will not believe where I'm heading to right now. <laughs> I'm actually going back to the GT um, Fashion Weekend or Fashion Fair, as Simi rightly corrected. Um, I'm going back with Ozzy and her sister. I'm just waiting for them to come out. Um, Ozzy wants to get some more pieces and we also want to try and catch the fashion show, the runway show. So hopefully we catch that. Uh, that would be really interesting to watch actually. And hopefully they allow me to vlog because I beg, it's not that deep. Also, if you guys can also recommend some linen vendors like linen vendors that make linen outfits especially sets pants and shirts and top i love linen so much i could wear this outfit every day every single day i especially like it for work for example if i have a meeting or it's like a business meeting and i'm not sure like what to wear i like to wear linen because linen is safe you get so if you guys can plug me with some people who sell some vendors who sell um, linen outfits that are like quality linen and nice styles please send them to my dm if you don't already follow me on instagram my instagram handle is veronica.ababio at veronica.ababio um so please go um dm me if you have any um suggestions or vendors or recommendations or where i can find some more sets like this because i can wear this every day i can live in this you know yesterday i was also talking about chris brown's new album see you guys need to listen to feel something messed up you need to listen to messed up in your car Whew. chris brown i know i've spoken about chris brown in three straight video or three straight videos or three videos straight i don't even know which one's correct but I've spoken to I've spoken about Chris Brown in all of the videos I've done the daily videos I've done it's just because he's just the goat he is just the goat also my brother came over earlier like every time my brother comes to see me I'm so happy so happy my brother came earlier to see me because um, like I said my car wasn't working so the mechanic came they came to check everything so he's working out like it was making that crazy sound but everything is stopped now um so my brother came and he spent like hours with me oh i love that guy that guy is just amazing love him so yeah every time i see my brother i'm like happy i'm excited anyways enough talk let's just get right into my activities do you guys know what this is this is the best popcorn in the world no cap see especially this one the cheese and caramel mix any first of all any cup popcorn that is cheese and caramel mix oh huh. a lot of things can take me away a lot of things including this popcorn because this popcorn is so good it's so delicious it's just premium and it's just popcorn get chills now that sounded like an ad like nobody sent me that message <laughs> No, but honestly, this is like one of the best popcorns ever. Anytime I see someone coming back from America, I always tell them to get me some of this popcorn. I love this one that is Creators or the... Um, there's another one also from Walmart that they have this mix. Cheese and caramel mix. It's so good. It's like savory and sweet. Just going in at the same time. Savory, sweet. Savory, sweet. But I like what you're wearing. Thank you. I need something like this. I will send them. Excuse me. I will send them the card that, if anybody can recommend where I can get for real sets like this, you should let me know. Cause this is what I like to wear. That's literally Lina. it. I could Lina. wear it to work every yeah. day, all day. I saw that every day. Like I like the it cause plain it's ones. safe. You yeah. The plain ones. I could wear it to church today. I don't want to yeah. dress up. And my truck. If you have a meeting, you're not sure how you should wear this one. Put heel. Put flats. Bam. Moxes, Anyone, the pass, yeah, good. Oh my god, it's hot. It's hot. I'm not used to this, guys. Oh, be quiet. We just didn't turn on the air. I'm not used to this. Not used to heat, oh. You guys, you know, I live the life of a rich and famous. <laughs> In my village. In what world? <laughs> In my village. In what world? In my village. Okay. Oh, right, you guys remember Ozzy from yesterday's video? Hello. She said, the booty, the booty is popping. Ah. <laughs> 
So I just got back from the GT Fashion Week and I'm just in awe of how great that fashion show was. So this is my first time ever going for the fashion show. I've gone for the fashion fair like bare times but this time I went for the runway show. Oh, I can't even lie. The production, the lights, the designers, everything was given. Everything was given. Like even let me tell you what even busted my head though during the break they were like oh they're gonna quickly share refreshments and all of that they're gonna take a maybe five minutes or something break the way they shared it quickly from the bag sharing it the popcorn the drink the i mean the ice cream everything sharp 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 i love how organized everything was then let's talk about the actual designers the designers oh there was one lady that did she had like a lingerie line i don't know if it was like lingerie to sleep or like maybe they're doing sleepwear to wear as per that's the new fashion i don't know but i'll show you a picture of one of them here here you go <laughs> anyways i don't know if that's the case Sha. she sha did lingerie line by the time she was coming out she was even crying because she just even me i felt it it was electric it was electrifying i don't even know what the meaning of like electrifying <laughs> But it was really really good like that her line was so good that was my favorite out of all of them and then the last guy i don't even know his name all his pieces were all his pieces were so strong and like they could all stand on their own i don't know how to explain but it was really really good the fashion show was good next time gt has a fashion week i definitely think you should try the runway show because i can't believe we have that in lagos like Lagos is just so so impressive the things that we can do in Lagos like the things that are happening in Lagos all you need to do is just stand up from your house or get on Instagram search what is going on this weekend or next weekend plan and go with your friends and stop saying that Lagos is dry because there's so much happening in Lagos so much I want to show you guys those products that I was talking about the last time the first one I want to show you guys is this native body wash in lilac and in lilac and white tea Ooh. you guys it gives luxury it gives hotel it gives high-end hotel it gives I'm not following you guys to do vanilla I'm here to stand on my own it's fresh like this Actually, I didn't even pick this out myself. My cousin Yvonne was like, oh, very actually going to really, really like this scent. And she sent it to me. I missed all that stuff that she sent to me. And she wasn't lying. So good. I highly recommend. Like, initially, if I was going to recommend a native body wash, I would have recommended the cocoa, coconut and vanilla one, which smells really good as well. Because I like, yeah, I like anything that smells like vanilla or coconut. And it smells really edible like my mouth is already watering just because i smelled this one so yeah but then i just feel like this coconut vanilla scent is like readily available this one this fresh scent sometimes like hard to find a good balance so i think this is actually a good um option to get if you like that fresh scent and then yeah this one like i said it's kind of easy to find but the scent is actually really strong as well Mm, it smells so edible. It actually smells. I can smell the coconut a lot more than the vanilla. This is what it looks like. Yeah. 
The next one is this body lotion. I'm sure you guys have seen it everywhere. It's the EOS um, Vanilla Cashmere Lotion. Um, 24 hour moisture body lotion. Huh. If I tell you, say I love it. Oh. My money, my body, now your own. Oh, no, vanilla. Eh, eh. You guys, I can't even lie. This. It, so, wait. Before I even go on, let me tell you my, the pros and the cons. This, if you like. A sweet smelling lotion body lotion it smells like vanilla it smells like caramel this but it smells really really sweet this is your go-to however it's not like for me it's not really moisturizing I'm going to try it out I've tried it out a couple of times like not my own bottle but I'm gonna try out this whole bottle and see how much I like it but from what I know so far it's not as moisturizing because I've used it a couple of times from other people it's not as moisturizing but I'm gonna try it out and I will let you guys know like what I think eventually then I got this bar soap dove bar soap from the supermarket here in Lagos um, I got it in go fresh this go fresh scent is mm, like the name implies fresh I don't know why we stopped using bar soap. I think I was kind of like, it's because I was using bar soap as a child and I just wanted to be a grown up. I don't know, for some reason, I just felt like when you get older, you start using body wash as a child, I'll be using bar soap. But then the bar soap that we were using when we were children was not giving like this. This Dove Go Fresh bar soap smells so good. Use the bar soap and then use wash. Girl. I know yes my shower routine is actually really long i should make a video one of these days showing you guys my shower routine my shower routine is actually long but use this use a body wash you'll be smelling like i'll do one very soon don't worry 